Now, the official Sun Coast weather with ABC7 meteorologist John Scalzi. So we'll watch today for a chance of some showers near the coastline and a warm start to the day. With 80 degrees, our current air temperature. Dew point is up there at 76 degrees, making it feel kind of sticky and a little bit humid outside. Some cloud cover has built and a southwest wind now at about 5. We'll watch that westerly flow continue to develop throughout the day today, and it's going to be important to the weather. The reason that we're getting that westerly flow is this big kind of gyre that you see over the state of Florida, this area of low pressure that's bringing a general counterclockwise twist to the radar imagery that you see. And that will tend to bring these showers and thunderstorms that are out in Gulf waters right now a little bit closer to the coastline during the morning hours. So there is a chance of seeing some coastal showers over the course of the next couple of hours. We have some in progress. In fact, some decent downpours of rain anywhere from about Siesta Key northward on up through Anna Maria. And uh, some of the storms have produced some fairly decent rainfall. Right now, just over the Ringling Bridge, we have some fairly good showers in progress as well. Those will gradually move inland as we progress through the morning hours. So, yes, there is a chance that uh, some of the school bus stops close to the coastline during the morning could be affected by a few scattered showers. High pressure building out in Gulf waters combined with an area of low pressure lifting north across the state are providing us with a general westerly wind flow throughout the day today, taking those showers that are near the coast now thanks to overnight land breezes and pushing them a little bit further inland as we progress through the morning hours. Good chances of rainfall inland, some of them heavy later on today. And then as we progress through the afternoon and into the evening hours, those inland showers will tend to drift back toward the coastline as our sea breeze kind of falls apart just a little bit. Sea breeze will get an early start today, aided by that high sitting out in Gulf waters. So the forecast calls for a slight chance for morning showers, but then the better chance for later day showers building probably around 2 or 3 o'clock in the afternoon in inland areas and then as we head into the early evening, drifting slowly back to the coast. So there'll be a smattering of showers throughout the day today. Heat index up there near 100. The RPM computer model shows those showers along the coastline early in the afternoon, moving inland and then gradually drifting back to the coastline. Tomorrow morning, more showers near the coast, followed by the same sort of pattern, building inland developing further out in Gulf waters. We'll watch that one area, 40% chance of showers way out in the Gulf, developing into perhaps some sort of a tropical system, but all computer models still in agreement that that system recurves back out into open waters. So it's a pretty good bet that's what's going to happen. Forecast calls for a 40% chance of showers over the next several days. Daytime highs steamy near the low 90s. Back to you guys.